Well, I am totally in love with our band this week, fresh off of a West Coast tour. It's Tour Tara. And this is Barrett Martin. How do you Welcome do? Welcome back to Seattle. Are you kind of a ringleader-ish, kind of? A bit of a ringleader in All a few right. bands, yeah. Yeah, and yeah. in this one? Uh, definitely in this one. Uh, Skerrick and I started the band in uh, 1996, so almost 20 years ago. Yeah. Well, yeah. let's introduce the guys, starting over there with Mr. Skerrick. <clears throat> That's the mighty Skerrick. He's the Swiss Army knife of the band. He plays everything. <laughs> That's a perfect way to describe him. <laughs> Hello, sir. And on the and trumpet. And on trumpet, Dave Carter, who came up from San Francisco to be here today. Oh, nice. Great to see you, Dave. And and uh, the other Swiss Army Knights, Steve Moore, oh, trombone and keys. We love Steve. And uh, I'm the drummer. And then over here, this is Evan Flory Barnes, the superb upright bassist and composer. And before we move on, I have to say that we think this might be Evan's fourth, fifth, or 20th appearance on Art Zone. And we have some prizes for you. Awesome. Sheila, <laughs> come on in. OK, so we have that. So we have a, so I show that. It's a little thing. And then we've got a crown for you. Yeah. 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 OK. Yeah, don't worry. That's, I think it fits him perfectly, right? Good. We got a little shots there for him. OK, beautifully done. Um, OK, now enough of that. And we're going to move on now to okay. our next guy. Not, and then all him. the way on the far left is the magnificent Andy Coe on guitar. Indeed. Andy, it's great to see you. A lot of you, of course, you've, we've had on the show before. Um, so like you said, you guys came together in 96? 96, 96, 96. Yeah. Yep. Well, How do you guys put the music together? Who composes it or writes it, or how does that happen? Well, it's kind of evolved over the years, depending on uh, who was in the band. I mean, initially, it was uh, myself, Peter Buck, Skerrick, and Justin Harwood from the, the band Luna. Uh -huh. Remember that band? Mm -hmm. And we would we would write all the music together, and, uh, and then over the years we've collaborated with singer songwriters, and uh, for example, uh, Mark Olson, Gary Loris from the Jayhawks, mm -hmm. uh, Victoria Williams, yeah. great singer songwriter. Uh, we did an album with Coleman Barks, the uh, Sufi poet, wow. and this latest album. Underworld. Underworld. Uh, Skerrick and I really wrote most of the music together. Uh -huh. uh, we we just collaborated with rhythms and he had uh, some beautiful exotic melodies from around the world and uh, and we got everybody in, in the original band to play on the record so right. Peter Buck is on the record Scott McCoy uh, Justin I had to go to New Zealand actually to get Justin Harwood to play bass oh but I gosh, did I flew to New it. Zealand you and I got it. him to play bass yeah and uh, so we made a, a double album that's awesome yeah. that's awesome um, so I also want to mention before we move on to the music to the or the other music that you have got um, Sedell Davis, uh, Last Man Standing. This yep. is a great CD, and you're working on a Mississippi blues project. You got a big show coming up June 14th at Crocodile. Real quick, what's that? Okay, so uh, I've been doing a lot of work in the Mississippi Delta, working with these uh, old Delta blues singers. Sedell Davis is 89 years old, and we made this new album with him called Last Man Standing. I'm bringing him to the Crocodile, which is, of course, ground zero for Seattle rock and roll. Yes. And uh, tickets just went on sale yesterday, yep. uh, June 14th. And we've got an all-star lineup, which includes everybody in Tuatara, but also Peter Buck from R.E.M., Mike McCready from Pearl Jam, my old Screaming Trees bandmate Van Connor, uh, myself on drums. And you. Myself on drums. Yeah. Aaron Jones, who's a and fantastic. And will be there. And Cedell, of course. We'll be, we'll be performing. We're going to do all these old Delta Blues song, so yeah. it kind of connects the Delta to Seattle rock and roll. Yeah, right on. Okay, well back to Tuatara. You've got a couple of songs off of uh, the record, which is Underworld, and the first one you're going to do is called? Gremlin Chain Gang. Gremlin Chain Gang. <laughs> All right, so are you fellas ready? Do you need to put down the trophy? I think so. <laughs> but keep, but <laughs> but keep, keep the, the crown, dude. Uh, yeah. Here, I'll take the trophy for you. I'll, I'll keep it safe. Okay. It. Ladies and gentlemen, it is Tuatara.